It was July 8th, uh, 2013. We had a horrific rainfall. We have approximately a 17 meter, 50 foot drop in our backyard. In other words, the backyard slipped into the ravine. What happened was the soil became saturated and the slopes failed uh, and in very close proximity to the houses. When we got home, my husband's friend was here in the backyard and he's like, you guys have no backyard. It had just completely washed away. It was really scary and it was still raining. In the morning, my husband just called, Conservation Authority came out and they took over. It's been like this just all going on two years. This project is special because we did it in a very short time frame because we had to, it was necessary. We started with a resident meeting. We met with everybody all together. We explained who we are, what we do, how our funding works. We explained the conditions of the funding uh, the, to have this work done. And then we started through the design process together where we explained, we looked at a couple different solutions and what the impact would be to their property until we came up with a solution that everyone agreed upon. And then we went forward with uh, the detailed design and the agreements uh, to construction. Based on the monitoring that my staff and I have done and the types of the records that we've been keeping, we certainly expect this to happen again. So part of our program is looking proactively at uh, other areas that might be at risk so that we can identify them and do some work. We're back here at Riverhead and now you can see that the work is pretty much complete. We're in the final stages of restoration. It looks beautiful. It's the first time I've been down here to see it close up, so I think you did a magnificent job. This is really nice to see. It's really well done. I'm actually quite impressed. 